Do, 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 do. Thank you, Captain Neku and Doncho. Hey, happy birthday, man. No, I will not do any voice acting because I don't have the voice for it. <laughs> My deduction wasn't wrong. If I hadn't identified Gonta as the culprit, we would all be dead. For the rest of us to survive, Gonta had to be sacrificed. There was nothing I could do. No. Correct, Malphus. Seven people left. I'm glad we're talking about how to escape, but where'd he go? Kokichi. He's fucking insane. He enjoys watching us suffer. His face just screams that he's having fun whenever he sees us suffer. He's not normal. There's obviously something wrong with him. What's his face from DR2? If we weren't in this killing game, I would have assassinated him already. Ironic. The rules of this game actually make it harder to kill. Maki roll. That's not good. Playing this killing game is just what Monokuma wants us to do. Hope man. The man of hope. Yeah? Is Maki Roll a nickname for Maki? That's a good nickname. It makes me want to take a bite out of her with soy sauce and spicy mustard. Right, Maki Roll? Don't die, Himiko, please. All right, our first priority is to solve the mystery of this academy. Let's investigate. Uh, I'll hold on to that. Oh, that's right. Without meeting my eyes, Kaido placed the key into my palm. Kaido, Shuichi, what's the matter? You both seem different today. Read the mood, Kibo. It's fine, so let's go already. Is this the exit? It seems like it. Look there. Oh, it's a door. On the other side of that door. Yeah, it's probably the outside world. Yeah, we did it! We can finally escape! Don't get your hopes up. We need to know if this is actually the outside world. You're right. We don't know what the outside world looks like now. It's fine. Monokuma was probably just lying to us. The skies over this academy are normal, so the meteorites are probably gone. Everything's fine out there. Anyway, let's open that door. We'll have plenty of time for talk afterwards. Beyond this door is our normal, peaceful, boring lives. We'll be able to go home to those normal lives. The secret of the outside world couldn't be that awful, right? Let's go. It's finally time to graduate from this academy of lies. With that, Kaido swung the electro hammer and <laughs> proceeded to die instantly. Smashed it down into the control panel. Thank you so garn for the year. Welcome back, man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh man, here it comes. What the fuck is it gonna be? Oh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, give it to me. Fuck. The world, the whole truth was revealed. The conclusion. This is the end. There is no outside world. We're the only humans left alive. Trying to get outside was pointless, and we played the killing game for it. It was all meaningless. That's the conclusion. N nonsense. So, what did all the others die for, then? So this is the despair that Gunta felt. So much despair you want to die. It really is just like that. If it's like this, it would have been better if I died a lot earlier. Then, it's all over now. That's true. This is the end of everything. Our story ends here. There will be no more death. No more killing game. It's all pointless. The truth is, we all should have just died a long time ago. 
and thus it was decided, fairly painlessly. The flashback light suddenly appeared. Nothing could be more obvious and suspicious. But because our spirits were already broken, we had nothing to lose anyway. Okay, I'm going to turn it on. Do it. Do it, no balls. And at that moment... Should I beg it? That's... That's it? I remember everything is connected and we had forgotten. We had forgotten that everything is connected. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps. Ooh. Ooh. That's a cool feeling. It all started at that academy. Oh, the music! A government-backed school that nurtured the most talented students in various subjects. Oh, yeah! Hope's Peak Academy. And the event that tore that school apart changed the world. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. It triggered a wave of terrorism and war across the world. Humanity's true despair. Half the world was destroyed as a result of the terrible violence. And that tragedy was caused by a single high school girl. My girl, Junko and Oshima. <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen you. She used whatever means necessary to paint the world in despair. Oh man, this takes me back, man. Holy shit. <laughs> The killing game of the 78th class of Hope's Peak Academy was the same way. Trapped by the ultimate despair, forced into a killing game. My main girl, my favorite girl of the series, right there in the back, Purple Chan, I forget her name. <laughs> my boy Weed Man. Kyoko, yeah, that's it. <laughs> Dude, names are hard to remember, okay? Fuck you, chat. But after Junko and Oshima died, the case was closed and the world began to slowly recover. Soda. Everyone, did you all remember? Hi. Yes, I can vividly recall everything now. Soda, yeah. yeah, why? How could we forget something so important? We were students of Hope Speak Academy. We were the symbols of hope entrusted with the survival of humanity. Except for one person. Kokichi Oma, the mastermind behind this killing game. His organization's real identity. We're all that's left of the 16 who survived the battle between hope and despair. If we give up now, everyone who fought on the side of hope will have fought for nothing. Fought for nothing. That's why my inner, what my inner voice is telling me. That no matter what, I cannot abandon hope. I cannot give up. Yes, that's what it's urging me to do. So I will not despair. Even if it's only a little, I will move forward with hope. Kibo. Right now, there is no use in thinking about whether our lives have meaning or not. Because as long as we're alive, we still have the power to decide that meaning for ourselves. That's what I believe hope is. That's what hope is, I see. Yeah, you're right. We're the students of the new Hope Speak Academy, rebuilt as the symbol of hope. If we, the students of Hope Speak, give up, the world really will be plunged into despair. I got it. In the end, it's all about willpower. I'm gonna live till the end and never give up. We won't be able to do anything in that destroyed world. 
but making the impossible possible is what magic is all about. It's a pain, but it'll be worth it. I'll live. I'll live for a hundred million more years. You guys, you're right. Let's do it. Let's fight together against despair. Yes, as long as we stand together without giving in to despair, we will find a new hope. A new hope. We all stood in unison. We each felt the power of hope coursing through us, driving our bodies. The hope born in this academy, a tree of life with roots down deep. It was supporting each and every one of us. Let's go. We all ran to the shutter at once. We won't let Kokichi do whatever he wants anymore. You'd better be ready. This is it. I have not, Destro. Should PM that to me. The remnants of despair in here and now. Well, I'll definitely look at some games. After opening the shutter, we burst into the hangar. Electro hammers in hand. To end this. To end this killing game. To end this despair. Oh, fuck. Rip, Kaido. Yup. Man, this is an empty elevator. We had lost the will to live, knowing what we know about the outside world. But somehow, despite that despair, we had found a new reason to live. To win the battle between hope and despair. But now, what do we know? We don't know what hope means to us anymore. What is hope? A burden you bear? What if he's not really the mastermind? Because he's a fucking pathological liar. Oh god, what's gonna happen? Is it Kaido? I hope it's Kaido. This is a robot. This is not a human. God damn it, Monokuma. Bitch. Eguisalu. Okay. It is Kaido. Yeah, my boy. But what if it's... What is this? Something still seems super off about this. Like, super off. <laughs> Some does seem right. Other than the giant robot. Oh, for f <laughs> uh. <laughs> just some robot with like pre-programmed in voices, isn't it? <laughs> Fuck sakes. <laughs> What is happening? Oh, 
でもさこのゲームにおける価値って何だろうか他のプレイヤーを出し抜くことなんかいや本当の意味でこのゲームに勝つってことはこのゲームを企んだ首謀者を出し抜くことは事件の真実だ the chat back now? Chat, can I bring you back now? Hello? No, man. Okay. I love you, though. I love you. Okay. Okay. Have fun doing sound effects without me. So, the Kakunoko is a Kanojoa, Toyre no Kanki Madokara, Nakaniru Jimbutsu, Kuroi Kesu, Watashita. So, the Uketota Jimbutsu Kosoga, Konojikin no Hani Nanda. Kakunoko no Toyre ni Kanki Sareta Haniwa, Yumeno Sani, Aru Buki o Hakonde Muratanda. その武器とは、春川さんの演技を使った組み立て式のクロスボウだ。スポットさんアート。犯人はこのクロスボウを使って自分を監禁した大間くんに戦いを挑むつもりだったんだ。その矢は大間くんの背中に命中した。しかもその矢は。ただの矢じゃなかったんだその矢には僕の研究教室にあった致死率 100% の毒薬肛門致死薬が塗ってあったんだ春川さんは大間くんに洗いざらい吐いてもらってから彼を殺すつもりだったらしいけどでもそんな毒に侵されても大間くんは真実を語ろうとはしなかった He's dedicated. Go on, yes, the Haruka Sama. Kareni Todomeo Sasbek. Tata be crossbow, ni dokeo set to see. Kiganeo heat up. Dakedo, Tsugino Shunka. Kondoa, Haruka Sani Totte. Omoimo Yorana Jitaga, Kotashima Tanda. Haruka Sao, Hitogoroshi Saseta Kunaka, the Hanninga.身を挺して大間くんをかばい自分の左腕に毒矢を受けてしまったんだ春川さんは僕の研究教室にある解毒薬のことを思い出しすぐに格納庫を飛び出した残された二人の体にはゆっくりと拷問致死薬が回り確実な死が訪れようとしていたでもこの絶体絶命の状況の中で大間くんは思いついていたんだこのアクシデントすらも利用した殺し合いに勝利するための嘘をね殺し合いに勝利することそれは物熊に勝つことそれこそが I can't imagine how this can get crazier than this. But we'll see. What happens after the closing argument? そして大間くんは格納庫のシャッターを閉め、春川さんが戻ってきても中に入れないようにした。それが大間くんの最後の嘘の始まりだったんだ。そしてエレクトボムを起動した後大間くんは犯人に解毒薬を飲ませたそして解毒薬を飲ませた後大間くんは犯人に計画に協力するようにお願いした大間くんの考えた嘘は犯人がいなければ実現不可能だからだ
命を救ってもらった負い目もあってその頼みを承諾してしまったんだ、うん、こうして2人は共犯とも異なる常識外れの協力関係を結んでしまうんだ大間くんがプレス機の操作盤の近くにビデオカメラを設置している間に。What explanation? ハニーはプレス機の台座に仰向けになった。上着の袖に両腕とも通さず、羽織るような格好でね。そして、大間くんがプレス機のスイッチとビデオカメラの再生ボタンを同時に押すと。犯人の上にプレス機がゆっくりと降りてきてその光景がビデオカメラに収められた本来プレス機には安全装置があるんだけどこれもエレクトボムの効果で無効化されていたんだそのままさらにプレス機は降りてきてカメラの視界から犯人の姿が消えた瞬間大間くんがプレス機の強制停止ボタンとビデオカメラの一時停止ボタンを同時に押したんだそれぞれの役割を交代したんだこれから殺される被害者とこれから殺す犯人とでねそしてさっきまで被害者役だった犯人が再びプレス機とビデオカメラを動かしたんだこれは被害者と犯人が協力してこそ成立するトリックこのために大間くんは犯人の命を救っておいたんだたとえ自分が死んでもこの殺し合いに勝利するためにねガーデンエグイサルに乗っている犯人それは君なんだよね超高校級の宇宙飛行士桃田海斗君 God if it's not Kaido or Kokichi in that thing I'm gonna lose it I'm just going to implode. So, n a n d e s h o So, go near n o a Momota k u n a n d e s h o w a r i g a For fa. Most temera a matching at a monokuma a s e k a s h i m a t r a Temera a o s i o k i t o o t o n i n a t i m a j a n e k a Stop being such a bro, Kaido, for like three seconds. Yeah, I should explain. Most of it's just like Shuichi said. You're cute. Then he told me I had to cooperate with his plan. I don't know, man. This trial is such a mind fuck. Like, Jesus Christ. Plan? What plan? I've been thinking this whole time of a plan to throw the mastermind off guard. Throw them off guard? What are you talking about? You're the mastermind. Oh, um, that was a lie. I only pretended to be the mastermind. Pretended? You all fell for it. But you know, I prepared a bunch of stuff. Like this remote control. I had Miyu make it. The mysterious message in the courtyard, using Gunta and making him a murderer. All that preparation was just to make you guys think I was the mastermind. What the hell? Why'd you do all that? The reason why I pretended to be the mastermind was to end this boring killing game. To end it? I thought if I showed you the despairing truth, you guys wouldn't want to go outside anymore. 
I already don't want to. I thought it would end the killing game, but instead, this happened. I'm gonna die by Maki's hands. Even now at the very end, I don't really understand Kokichi. But maybe that's what lying is all about. The truth is in the eye of the beholder, huh? Kokichi was the very embodiment of a lie. Oh no. Jesus. Kaido? K Kaido! Kaido, are you okay? <laughs> How can I be okay? I'm about to die. You sure are, bucko, because it's punishment time. <laughs> Woke. Last off. What? Man, that's rude. Salute. Oh no. Get fucked. Woo. Oh, baby. God damn. After all that, I honestly don't remember how we got back. It took all I had just to accept the reality that Kaido was gone. And not just Kaido, Kokichi too. Someone we all trusted, and someone none of us trusted. We lost them both. Oh, hey Zeke. But it wasn't all for nothing. Because we're drawing ever closer to discovering the true mastermind. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. I knew it. <laughs> uh. <laughs> the killing game will never end. Never ever. As long as I'm around, it'll never end. It'll repeat over and over and over. Why would I let something this fun ever end? I want to have more fun. As long as it's fun, we have to keep doing it. That's just simple supply and demand. God, that was a chapter and a half. God damn. <laughs>